So what will impact the cost of a BAS system? Uh, that's going to be, uh, it's going to be answered by more questions. Is this a new building or is this a retrofit? Uh, is there an existing control system or are we starting from scratch? Uh, you know, that ranges anywhere from $2.50 a square foot to $7.50 a square foot. It varies very much with the criteria that you have to meet. If there's like some stringent, uh, alarming and long term histories, uh, like if you have FDA requirements, there's things that can require you to hold seven years worth of data, you know, all that's going to impact the cost on the building automation system. Ongoing maintenance can vary uh, wildly with your building as well, whether you have uh, you know, several hundred dollars a month of a budget you need to have or tens of thousands. And of course, that would be extremely large, you know, multi-campus spanning facilities and you know, the other, of course, being you know, maybe it's your, your local house of worship. But it, it varies very much by the amount of equipment you have and the level that you require. The needs of the facility can vary greatly. We can have sites that we only go visits with once a quarter, um, just for the beginning of the heating season, just for the beginning of the cooling season, at a very minimal, two visits a year. And then you know, we have the, the absolute 100% staffed, you know, 365 um, with, uh, with after hours one call and you know, just dedicated to 100% of your facility, so it, it varies greatly. Uh, but if you do not maintain the control system, if you've got bad information back to the control board, then it's going to make the wrong control algorithm happen. You know, we're gonna, the, a very simple way to put it is, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna burn a candle at both ends. You're gonna be using too much energy in one end or the other. Uh, it's easily caught through a conventional, um, just maintenance check. You know, this is something that, does need to be maintained. It's not a set it and forget it. You know, it is something that is dynamic. So what are some other things that contribute to the cost of the BAS? Uh, the type of the control system, the manufacturer, uh, is going to be a cost of drivers versus a complete, uh, you know, retrofit where the old control system may have to be pulled out, new controls put in. If you were to put a driver, this would allow us to utilize the existing controls and maintain that initial investment with just a little bit of a uh, additional investment to get the driver uh, installed and integrate that platform and bring it up to the 21st century. So the more systems that you need to integrate, the more the impact you're going to have on the cost of the BAS. Like for example, if you're just doing HVAC or if you're doing HVAC and fire, card access control, um, you know, every time you need, have another need to pull in a system, um, there's going to be some costs associated to consider and, uh, when you're planning your BAS.